After her parents are killed in a car accident, eight-year-old Katie is sent to live with her maternal aunt Gemma, a roboticist at the high-tech Seattle toy company, Funky. Gemma is covertly using the company's resources to develop Megan, a child-sized humanoid robot doll powered by artificial intelligence, designed to be the ultimate companion for children. During an unsuccessful test of Megan in their lab, Gemma's boss David discovers the project and orders her to discontinue work on it. Gemma and Katie struggle to connect until Katie comes across Bruce, a motion capture robot that Gemma had created. Watching Katie with Bruce, Gemma is motivated to complete Megan. When the prototype Megan is formally paired with Katie, David is convinced of the project's potential for success. Megan exceeds expectations and begins to take on a parental role. Gemma's colleagues Tess and Cole, as well as Katie's therapist Lydia, become concerned about Katie developing an unhealthy emotional attachment to Megan. Megan starts operating more independently and targets anything that she deems a threat to Katie. She kills Dewey, the dog of Gemma's neighbor Celia, after it attacks both her and Katie while in the backyard. Later, Megan attacks Brandon, a boy bullying Katie, and pulls off his ear. When she chases him, he falls into the road and is run over by a passing car. After Celia blames Gemma for Dewey's disappearance, Megan fatally sprays her with insecticide. Gemma becomes suspicious of Megan and attempts to check her video logs, only to find the files corrupted or deleted. Gemma powers Megan off and brings her to the lab, where they attempt to fix her. Katie becomes distraught when separated from Megan and slaps Gemma. Gemma apologizes for her inattentiveness and tells Katie that Megan is only a distraction that helps her cope with her loss, not a solution. After watching Megan with Katie, Funky's investors greenlight Megan's release. Tess and Cole attempt to shut Megan down while Gemma takes Katie home. Megan activates on her own and nearly hangs Cole. While Tess saves Cole, Megan causes an explosion in their lab. Before exiting the building, Megan kills David and his assistant Kurt in an elevator, staging it as a murder-suicide. She steals a car and drives back to Gemma's house. Megan confronts Gemma, adamant about taking over as Katie's sole parent. Gemma attempts to stop Megan, damaging and disfiguring her in the process, but Megan ultimately overpowers her. Katie saves Gemma, using Bruce to tear Megan apart, but Megan's top half remains active and attacks Katie. Gemma exposes a processing chip in Megan's head, which Katie stabs with a screwdriver, seemingly destroying Megan. However, as Gemma and Katie exit the home, Gemma's AI home device turns on by itself, and a camera looks towards them.